2015 has been an improved season for the Kenyan ladies volleyball team and with five matches left in the regular season, the ladies have a chance to have a winning record for the first time in 25 years. And joining us to talk about this season so far is freshman Skylar Stapika. Skylar, obviously you came in here as a freshman knowing the culture around here has been one that needs needed to be improved. And this year, you know, we're very competitive in practically every match. What have you made this uh, this season as a freshman? You know, maybe a little wide-eyed out there on the court, but what have you made of our efforts this season and, uh, you know, just battling each and every week? Yeah, um, I'm proud of some of the things we've accomplished so far. Um, it's really exciting for me to be a part of a program that's growing and is hopefully um, just going to keep improving every year. Um, I think we've been really competitive in some really high-stakes matches. We just have to work on, um, you know, being air-free in the points where it really counts so we can pull out those wins and have our efforts reflect um, be reflected in our um, in our scores. Recently, uh, DePaul came in here. You know, it was a competitive match all the way throughout. Muskingum prior to that, and you know they came in with a winning record, and we knocked them off. And I know we saw the sixth ranked team in the nation last night in Wittenberg, and gave them a little worries after that first set. Uh, you know, how do we kind of maintain you know that level of play for all the sets? I know that's that might be a tough question, but you know, how do we go in with each match knowing? we got to have a level of, uh, you know, a level of intensity to keep up with, you know, some really good teams. Yeah, that's actually been a focus of the coaches, just trying to work on our mental game, because I think that's where we need the most work. Um, but we've figured out that we're a pretty high-energy team. We play the best when we're cheering a lot and having fun. Um, so we've really worked on trying to celebrate every point, whether it's, you know, another team's error, which maybe might not be exciting, as exciting, but always to just celebrate whenever we win. And even if, you know, we make a mistake, just to come ready for the next point. And so to keep that high mental game the entire match. Speaking of excitement, when we come up with those block assists on uh, opponents' attacks, I mean, that gets the crowd going maybe more than, a, a, you know, a, an assist to a kill. Mm -hmm. uh, describe, you know, you're in the middle with Lauren. Uh, Jensen Sherbert has come up with some blocks. Tierney can, can get up there. Just describe our, you know, kind of our defensive mentality. And we've obviously had some, some really great play in the middle this year, especially when we had some, uh, some added height as this roster does. Yeah, um, for me, it's even more exciting to get a block than a good kill because not only do I get a point for my team, I also kind of shut down the other team and maybe make them lose some confidence. Um, so we've really been focusing on blocking because if we can, um, if we can win the game at the net, we make it a lot easier for our defense. Um, and we've just proven that when we are blocking well in a game that we're much more successful. So that's definitely been a focus of ours. And then offensively, Delaney has come in along the outside and has done a really good job. Obviously, Tierney in her second year has done a really good job. But also in the middle, you know, Lauren Kerr and yourself, kind of, you know, a little tandem duo uh, that has uh, produced for us. Offensively, what has kind of stuck out in your mind having a, a roster that's it, being able to get it done inside and out? Yeah, it's been really exciting for me to be a part of. I have a lot of respect for my other hitters. Um, they, I mean, they're great. Delaney's come in and has really, she's a great all-around player to have front row and back row. Um, so I'm just really honored to be a freshman and being able to play alongside these girls who are very good at what they do. And speaking of that, ha have you found yourself still, I know you're a freshman and you got a, you know some, uh, some learning curve uh, here in the collegiate ranks, but has it been an easy transition for you? Or uh, just describe your freshman year if you can. Um, actually, the volleyball team has really aided in my transition being a freshman, coming in with that small community, having you know juniors and seniors already looking out for me. Um, so I really am grateful for that community. Um, I think personally I need to focus on my blocking especially. Um, that's probably my weakest point as a freshman, not having as much experience there. Um, but as far as like the social dynamic of the team, it's really great, and they've made a very smooth transition for me. Uh, like I said earlier, we have five matches left in the regular season. We've got Allegheny tomorrow, and I know in conference play, we've got some really good teams in our conference. We play them tomorrow. We play Worcester next week. What's it going to take for us to, you know, kind of get a couple conference wins and, you know, just kind of, you know, feel good about ourselves in the North Coast uh, as the, the season winds down. Yeah, I think our mentality needs to be expecting two wins, um, one against Allegheny and one against Worcester, so we can be in that um, NCAC uh, tournament. Um, I think we just need to play with lots of energy, focus on our mental game. Um, lots of times we'll come out really strong in the first set and then have a second game lull is what we call it because it happens a lot. So if mm -hmm. we can eliminate that and just play with the same level of intensity, um, if we can play like we did in our first set against Wittenberg um, throughout an entire match, I think we'll be um, ready for success. Have you enjoyed this year so far? Yes, very much so. I think volleyball has been one of my favorite parts of my Kenyan experience so far.
Awesome. Well, Skylar, thank you for your time, and uh, we'll catch up with you later. Thank you very much. That was Skylar Stapika, a freshman middle blocker from Sylvania, Ohio. The ladies taking on Allegheny tomorrow at 2 o'clock at Tom Sick Arena. And it's also the ladies' dig pink match, so they'll be taking donations as they fight the battle against breast cancer. For Skylar, I'm Clayton Kaufman. We'll see you next time on the Kenyan Sports Connection.